All right, folks, if you go to InfoWarsLife.com, you can order the nascent atomic pure iodine that Dr. Group and others, you know, set up front is the very best. And I've been taking it for two months and just had incredible response. Uh, but if there are other forms of, of iodine, pharmacist Ben Fuchs, explain to me why iodine is so important. Oh, and, and, and then also some of the other minerals and things I'm told you need to take with it to have it actually work properly. I've also been detoxing while I've been on it in ways I've never experienced. Um, just for me personally, and, and Dr. Uh, Group said this would happen, mental clarity, energy, you name it. But I've also been detoxifying some. Uh, I mean, wh what's the difference between nascent iodine and the other iodines uh, that are out there? Uh, nascent iodine is electrified iodine. Technically, it's called atomic iodine. Minerals are usually complex with other substances, or sometimes they're complex with themselves. What makes nascent iodine so neat is the fact that all of the electrical energy is kept on the iodine atom. The, the electrical energy is not spread across iodine atoms or across potassium as it is in Lugol solution and some of the other iodine supplements. With nascent iodine, you get an electrified iodine atom. And what that means is the body sucks up nascent iodine really rapidly. It doesn't have to metabolize it or break it down the way it does when you, have, when you take a potassium iodide product like Lugol solution. And Lugol solution is still a good form of iodide, but it doesn't even come close to the electrified version, the nascent iodine version. Well, also, the electrified tastes good compared to the other ones. Well, you're getting electrical activity. You're getting a, a, a the Lugol solution tastes awful, absolutely hideous. But with the uh, nascent iodine, you're getting a cleaner form of iodine than you would be getting if you use the Lugol solution. But the neatest thing about the nascent iodine is the fact that it's bioavailable. And as you know, Alex, when it comes to nutrition, it's not what you're taking, it's what your body is using. And with nascent iodine, you're maximizing what we call bioavailability, and that makes it the most superior form of iodine. Now, there's other forms of iodine, of course. We've been talking, I've talked on this program a lot, and I talk on my program a lot about Lugol solution. We've talked in the past about uh, a product called iodorol, there's seaweed. There's various ways that you can get iodine, but to make absolutely sure that you're getting this essential mineral, in my opinion, you should be using the nascent iodine. And you, you, hit, you said something very interesting. Most people don't realize that iodine is an important brain element. It's important for the developing brain, and it's important for the adult brain as well. And so the mental clarity that you get, the sense of, uh, the mental sense of well-being that you get, it's a very common, these are very common benefits of iodine that people don't talk a lot and about. And meanwhile, yep. when the government actually cared about us, they put iodine in the salt. Now they take it out and put fluoride in the water. The opposite, explain what that does. This is that's, all on purpose. Yeah, well, that's a very good point. You see, if you look at the periodic table, you'll find that the periodic table of elements is divided up into columns. And all of the columns, all of the substances in each column are related to each other. Well, in the second to last column, this is called the halogen column, you've got three elements that are very similar, four elements that are very similar to each other. One is iodine, another is bromine, another is fluoride, and another is chloride. And the body gets confused. I would rather have iodine, but in the, if there's no iodine, it's going to take in whatever it can take. So in the, in the, uh, if there's a lack of iodine under a circumstance where there's not enough iodine, the body's going to take in fluoride. The body's going to take in chloride or chlorine. The body's going to take in uh, bromine as well. And you end up with brominosis. You end up with fluoride, uh, fluoride deposits in the pineal gland. You end up with weaker bone. You can end up with chlorine toxicity. All of this can be counteracted by supplementing with iodine. And if you don't supplement with iodine, if you don't have iodine, you're on higher risks of, all, of, of brominosis and, and toxicity from fluoride as well as from chlorine as well. So if you look at the periodic table, that's all you need to know. Look at the column, you'll see iodine, and then you'll see fluoride, and then you'll see bromine, and then you'll see chlorine. Three toxins, one nutritional element. You want to make so sure that you're getting So nascent iodine isn't just good for you, it's a survival shield. Abs not only is it a survival shield, it's anti-fluoride, it's anti-bromine, it protects your pineal gland. In addition to all these benefits that we're talking about, it protects the most important gland in the body, the pineal gland, which regulates everything. Alex, if you wanted to destroy a culture, if you wanted to destroy a civilization, if you wanted to destroy a species, you could do no better job than to target the pineal gland, which is exactly what fluoride in the water does, not to mention chlor uh, chlorine in the water, not to mention bromine in flour and in in Mountain Dew and soda pop and in plastics, et cetera. We have created this environment where we are immersed, saturated in toxicity. And then what's crazy is we do a lot of bad stuff on our own, but the establishment is actually doing a lot of this on purpose to politically control us. And then you research them 
whether it's the communist Chinese leaders or the European leaders or the U.S. leaders, they're all obsessed with everything you're saying, pharmacist Ben Fuchs. They're all on the nascent iodine. They're all eating the non-GMO food. They're all purifying their water. They know exactly what they're doing. I want to come back and talk more about iodine deficiency during pregnancy may adversely affect children's mental development. I've got some of the big medical studies here. We're giving you the big secrets, folks. They don't want you to know with pharmacist Ben Fuchs. We'll give you his website when we come back as well. If you go to InfoWarsHealth.com, you can sign up there and get 10% discounts. You can um, get free shipping when you sign up for auto ship. You can pay 10 bucks and get big discounts uh, and it also supports the broadcast. Ancient Legacies Oceans Gold, uh, 60 uh, tablets, uh, caplets uh, from Longevity at InfoWarsHealth.com features a proprietary blend of marine botanicals, a whole wide spectrum of coenzyme Q10 to support healthy thyroid, regular heartbeat, normal weight, uh, mood stabilization, hormone levels, supplement facts, and then it goes through all of it there on the site from Longevity at InfoWarsHealth.com. And yes, I'm selling you stuff here. I sell high-quality ProPure water filters to fund our operation that I personally use for my family that cut out massive amounts of the garbage that's in the water for my children and my family. Uh, I, I use the Longevity products at InfoWarsHealth.com. Uh, I, uh, with, with a doctor group, went out and found the very best uh, nascent iodine for survival shield at InfoWarsLife.com. That's what we do here. But, but separately, uh, any iodine, is, is, uh, you know, that, uh, that I guess is in the salt, you can still buy where they add it, but they don't put it in there, I guess, by law now. Uh, I would guess from a pharmacist Fuchs is better than the other three things on the periodic table that we know are bad, like uh, the uh, chloride and the fluoride and the rest of it, going in and filling these organs and these glands that need the thyroid uh, you know, to operate and need it to have iodine to do that. But you're the expert, pharmacist Ben Fuchs, brightsideben.com uh, is, of course, your syndicated radio show website, brightsideben.com. Continue to get into, uh, you know, really the key here, why iodine? Well, I mean, answer my question. If people can't get our super nascent iodine, uh, if people and the other stuff out there, I tried to find other stuff, believe me, to fill the orders. It's just no good. I can't sell it. I don't think it's real nascent iodine. I'm sorry. It tastes like rocket fuel. This stuff tastes great. And no one else seems to have it. It's like it's like a lost art, I'm told. So where do people else get this naturally? I mean, I'm told that the uh, certain types of the seaweed that are in the ancient legacy oceans, that, that, that they do uptake and then metabolize and have the good iodine. Explain to me what type this is and, and where people can get it if they can't get nascent iodine. Well, the big problem with iodine, Alex, is it's not a terrestrial mineral. It's an ocean mineral. So the sources of iodine, the best sources of iodine are ocean products, seaweed and seafood. But, of course, we know that uh, seafood has got the mercury in it, so you've got to be a little bit careful. But seaweed has a really neat property in that it, has a, it can purify toxins. So when you eat seaweed products ocean vegetation products, use seaweed supplements, you get a minimal amount of toxicity and you get a good amount of iodine. And I've been talking about eating seaweed for a long time. In addition, uh, Celtic sea salt and ocean salts tend to be better sources of iodine than iodized salt. You know, the iodine, form of iodine they put in iodized salt is not an absorbable form. And then you've got to deal with excipients and flow agents and all of the other things they put in into the salt and non-nutritional substances that they put into salt. If you use something like Okay, so let's be specific. When you go to the store, you want organic. People say, well, salt can be organic anyways. No, it can actually be mixed with things that aren't organic. What type do you need? Celtic sea salt or Himalayan salt. There's actually hundreds of different gourmet salts, but look for Celtic sea salt and look for uh, uh, look for a Himalayan salt. Here's something neat about salt. Uh, it's, it's kind of similar to uh, some of the benefits that you get with iodine. Iodine is also very important for the body's stress gland, the adrenal glands. In fact, all salt is important for the adrenal glands. And one of the reasons why we crave salt so much is because our adrenal glands are fried because we're under so much stress. So when you're under a lot of stress, you're going to find yourself craving salt. And what does the doctor tell you? Stay away from salt. Watch your salt intake. So people are on these low salt diets. That not only exacerbates problems with stress, it not only reduces the body's stress response, but it induces these terrible salt cravings that everybody has. I mean, you cannot go without salt. You may try to if your doctor tells you, but you're going to find yourself gravitating towards salty foods. So what you do is you, pre you, you act preemptively. You get yourself some Celtic sea salt or some Himalayan salt or even 
any good mineral product that can help uh, provide some salt, some salts for the adrenal glands. And you drink salt water. And you don't drink a lot of it, you just drink, drink just enough until your salt cravings disappear. And what you'll find is you have better adrenal gland functioning, which means more energy, which means a better uh, ability to respond to stress. And it also means the manufacturing of fertility and anti-aging and growth hormones. These are the kinds of strategies that the medical model is promoting that shut down our ability to thrive. Almost everything you hear from the mainstream medical model is almost intentionally designed to keep us from thriving. I was about to say, you know, I've been doing research the last few years trying to get back in shape from being totally unhealthy for years and just not caring about myself and figuring they'd kill me anyway, so why bother? I've been busy, you know, trying to lose 40, 50 pounds, lost most of it to get back in shape. It's, it's really hard to get back in shape once you've gotten out of it. And I talked to you and so many other experts. And I said, well, what's, a, what's an herb, what's a vitamin, what's a mineral that say has natural growth hormone uh, or will boost my natural testosterone to help me exercise more? And you said, iodine, iodine. It will then regulate the thyroid and other glands and allow you to release the stuff you need. And indeed, that's happened. My problem is I'm not even lifting weights uh, except for once a week, really light reps. I'm trying to get small, not big. And instead, I've lost some weight. But with my clothes off, I mean, you know, it looks like I'm trying to be a bodybuilder or something. That's not what I want. So what do I need to do, pharmacist Ben Fuchs? Because I do still eat like a pig. You I guess, it, you know. <laughs> you can't help getting ripped. That's going to happen, Alex. You're just going to have to wear long sleeve shirts, buddy. Because once your body, once you start to lose body fat and once you start to replace that body fat with muscle mass, you're just going to get ripped. You know, that's just one of the things that happens. And as you say, the, the iodine regulates the thyroid. Yeah, but I'm telling you, this iodine is like anabolic steroids or something. I mean, I'm literally it's, turning into a gorilla. It's, and, I, and I go in and lift weights now, and it's just like, it's unbelievable. It's not like I'm 18. You're fueling your thyroid. Your thyroid next to your pituitary or your pineal gland, your thyroid may be the most important gland in your body. It regulates every single cell in the body. And by the way, we were talking about the adrenal glands. There's a very important link between the adrenal glands and the thyroid. Once your adrenal glands are stressed out, once you're maxing out with adrenal hormones and your adrenal glands are trying to deal with your stressed out life, over time, the thyroid will gradually slow down. And this is one of the reasons why stress makes you gain weight. This is one of the reasons why hypothyroidism is such an epidemic and making sure that you're getting enough iodine. And by the way, selenium and iodine work together to help fuel the thyroid. This is one of the reasons why once you start taking in these supplements that help the thyroid, you'll lose weight, you'll gain more muscle mass, not to mention the fact that you're gonna feel better and have more energy as well. And by the way, there's something called fluoride fatigue, which is, a, which is caused by uh, excess ingestion of fluoride, affecting the thyroid and causing hypothyroidism and a sluggishness. Once you, get in, once you start taking in, taking in iodine, your body will uh, start to absorb less fluoride, and you know, once again, you'll have better thyroid functioning and you'll have more muscle mass, more energy, better, uh, uh, better immunity, more clarity of thinking, as well as weight loss. Simply incredible. And, and again, this power structure knows this. I mean, being a pharmacist, being a successful compounding pharmacist, a guy that has natural lines of cosmetics, you name it, you don't brag about yourself, but you're very successful, really smart guy. I mean, uh, interviewing you the last four or five years, uh, I know more and more you've researched the political more, and I've sent you documents where they admit all this stuff, but this is a conscious program. It's putting the bisphenol A in, removing even the, you know, the junky iodine, putting in the fluoride, putting the fluoride in as an additive to most of the processed foods. It levels thousands of times above the water uh, Alex, level. I mean, I mean that, that, this is murdering people. Alex, you know as well as I know, who, who were the first people to put fluoride in the water? Who were the, what was the first country that, to start using fluoride? The communists, the, Russians, and then the Nazis. Right? Exactly. And this is the kind of stuff that we're putting in our water here in this country. That are, You can actually go to the drugstore and get fluoridated water for your baby. Nursing water, they call it, where you drown your baby's brain in fluoride. As if it's not, they can't wait until we're adults and we're drinking tap water. Now you can fluoridate your baby. And by the way, as a prescription drug, fluoride is limited to 2.2 milligram doses, uh, daily doses. You get far more than that if you drink half a gallon of water, a gallon of water. Oh, yeah, day. we're being forcibly medicated, and the water right. is nothing. They spray it on the crops as, as one of the main pesticides. That's another one. And due to lawsuits, last year they announced they're phasing it out as an illegal pesticide by 2014. You're getting, when you, when you eat vegetables, that veg, the vegetables are saturated in 
of fluoride, fluoridated water, tap water, not to mention all the other crap that's in the tap water. So you can't even eat vegetables safely. Even, by the way, organic vegetables can have this but problem. But nation fluoride. iodine blocks it. That's right. That's right. That's, I can, you know, there is so many reasons to get on this nascent iodine as a supplement, as a daily supplement every single day. Uh, from, from protection from bromine and chlorine and fluoride to protection for the thyroid to protection for the various glands. What do body. I take it with again? Selenium. Selenium and iodine work together, especially for the thyroid. You, and that's one that Dr. Wallach's been talking about for many, many years. Selenium is a super, super incredibly important mineral uh, and one that many of us are deficient in. It's important for protection from cancer, important for protection from, uh, from uh, heart disease. It's an important product, uh, a component of something called glutathione, which is your body's major cancer fighter. Selenium has got so many wonderful benefits. It's active in very, very small amounts. And even being active in small amounts, many people are deficient in selenium. Always take iodine and selenium together. They work together for the thyroid. By the way, I had some of my friends' family over Sunday night for a dinner party, and I didn't know that they'd signed up under InfoWarsTeam.com or members at InfoWarsHealth.com uh, for, for two years. And, I mean, this is a true story. And they said they'd come on the show, and they're sitting there. My wife made dinner. We're eating. They go, listen. My wife couldn't even get out of bed with uh, the uh, arthritis she was having, the rheumatoid arthritis, and that she got on the Beyond Tangy Tangerine and the Alex Pack and the, and the uh, FX system and the joint uh, things that Dr. Wallach recommended at InfoWars Health, and that within six months, it was almost all gone, and now it's gone. It's gone. Now she doesn't have the arthritis anymore. And, he, and her hands were even giant and swole up. And now that's almost all gone away. And again, it's just incredible that, that this is more people telling me this and saying this is incredible. And I mean, I know it's good for you, but I can't believe how good just basic stuff is. Yeah, it's incredible. And you know, I'm a pharmacist and I, I'm very careful about the things I recommend and the things that I promote. And I'm telling you, Alex, when I see the kind of responses that people get when they start a nutritional supplement program, they get on the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, they get on some of these things that we talk about on the program, it blows me away and I can't shut my mouth. It's not, it would not be fair of me as a healthcare professional to not tell people about the benefits of these things, to not tell people about the Beyond Tangy Tangerine. And I don't like being a salesperson. I don't feel comfortable being a salesperson. I'm a healthcare professional. But as a healthcare professional, I have a sacred duty to tell people about things that I see work and that I know work and that have a, a theoretical basis as well as a clinical basis for working. And so when I talk about the Beyond Tangy Tangerine or nascent iodine or selenium or the Longevity products, I'm telling you this because I know the stuff works and as panacea and incredible sounding as it is it is a panacea and it is incredible and i say on my radio show every day you're going to think it's a miracle but it's not a miracle it's just the way the body works now this is now 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 what about the 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 nascent iodine detox i've been on about a month and a half or so and was just so much energy super aggressive it's losing it's weight still eating like a pig all this stuff, but then about the last week, I still have a lot of energy, but I am noticing, I don't want to go into what a detox is like, but, you know, there's different ways to detox your skin, other ways. I'm really detoxing now, and Dr. Uh, group was saying, maybe I want to slow down. I mean, I'm taking the recommended dose, uh, you know, that the establishment recommends, but, but maybe I should slow down for a while, uh, be because it does feel like I have a hangover sometimes in the morning now. Make sure you're doing other nutrients that support detox. And, and one of the most important nutrients isn't really a nutrient at all, but it's water. Drinking more water will help you flush out toxicity. Also, there's a very important relationship between vitamin C and iodine. Vitamin, uh, vitamin C can help you retain iodine much more effectively, and vitamin C has some wonderful detox properties as well. And this is one of the neat reasons, this is one of the most important reasons and the neatest things about getting on a supplement program. Alex, to a well-balanced program. All the individual nutrients have very interesting properties, iodine for the thyroid and vitamin C for immunity and selenium for the heart uh, and for making glutathione. But what you really want to focus on is getting on an entire program, a well-balanced program that provides you with all 90 essential nutrients. Each one has its own importance. And that's why Beyond Tangy Tangerine 2.0 exactly. organic is exactly. so important because it's all right there. Exactly. And then you can supplement on top of that. So, so exactly. obviously, I forgot. I, I need to take selenium. Now, now, what do I do if from fluoride most of my life until I woke up to it has, 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 has kind of calcified in my thyroid, in my pineal? Uh, is it true that nascent iodine long-term, if it's the proper type, 
uh, wow. can actually help you begin to actually slough some of that out? Absolutely. Once your body gets the good stuff, Alex, it doesn't take the bad stuff. It loses the bad stuff. Once you start taking iodine, the fluoride will drop off. The bromine will drop off. The calcium, which is, uh, or is in response to the, to the fluoride, will start to drop off as well. You can also use other uh, uh, chelating nutrients. Vitamin C, chelating means magnetically attract, and there's nutrients that will magnetically attract fluoride out of your body. Selenium is a wonderful chelating agent that can magnetically attract fluoride out of your body. Vitamin C is tremendously chelating. It can uh, help attract uh, uh, help attract a fluoride out of your body. There's something called N-acetylcysteine, NAC, which is tremendously, maybe the most important chelating agent you could ever use. You can use N-acetylcysteine. By the way, N-acetylcysteine is great for hangovers. It's great for any toxicity in the body. You can use that on a regular basis. Sulfur has got some tremendous chelating properties, things like MSM sulfur, and you can, of course, find sulfur in, in, in fresh vegetables. Uh, and fresh fruits and vegetables. There's the, you you want to make sure you're pounding your body with these chelating agents as well as antioxidants. Vitamin E, by the way, works together with selenium and vitamin A and something called alpha and vitamin, uh, vitamin C. Vitamin C, vitamin E, and selenium all work together as well as something called alpha lipoic acid, which you don't hear very much about. You don't hear hardly anything about alpha lipoic acid, but it's got some tremendous chelating properties. So pound yourself with these chelating agents and you'll magnetically pull that fluoride out of your body and you'll support the work that the iodine is doing to dump fluoride off of the pineal gland. So literally, things like nascent iodine, from what I've heard from you and others, they go around electrically charged and grab the fluoride and things and drag it out of your body. It's all about the electricity, Alex. Nascent iodine is electrified iodine. And anytime you electrify a nutrient, you improve the body's ability to utilize it. Incredible. I, I want to come back and ask you about politics and what's happening in the world. I want to start getting into that after the break, but look at this. Iodine deficiency during pregnancy may adversely affect children's mental development, and that's out of the medical press, and then they link through to a new study uh, on that. But, I mean, uh, that was in the Lancet Medical Journal. I mean, they've known this forever. I read about 100 years ago in England where they were saying kids had low IQ from not enough iodine. That's why they started putting it in the, in the salt. I mean, they're always acting like they just discovered this. They were using nascent iodine 100 years ago or close to 100 years ago. We've known about the importance of nascent iodine as well. Now, you guys are right on top of it, Alex. That whole nascent iodine thing, you are right on top of it, and, and jumping on nascent iodine is one of the smartest things you could do. Well, no. I mean, you're the one who told me, get on nascent iodine. It was six months a year ago. I remember I called you up, and I said, what is a good supplement uh, you know, to naturally give more energy and, uh, and boost my thyroid? And you said nascent iodine. And then I tried a bunch. They were so horrible tasting and didn't do anything. And then I ran into Dr. Group. And, man, this stuff's unbelievable. The problem is we can't make enough of it. So, But um, I've got mine, and that's what matters. Uh, we'll be right back, my friend. I want to get into the politics, the shutdown that now supposedly ended today, and so much more. But, folks, if you want to get it back ordered, it comes in in about two weeks. So it should be three weeks out. Survival Shield, Nation Iodine, InfoWars Life. And I dare you, try other people's and then get this. You'll get this at night. Night and day. Night and day. Hello, this is Hank Hill, and I'm telling you what, you need to listen to Alex Jones. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Infoworth.com. Yeah. <clears throat> hey, Judge, what is the secret of the universe? <laughs> Infoworth.com. Yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> People ask why DrudgeReport.com is the number one news website in the world, and it's because Matt Drudge knows what's important news. And we have the letter, and we've made calls, and they're not denying that it's a real letter. And I happen to have a reporter. All my other reporters are busy. My wife used to do reporting for us <clears throat> many years ago. Uh, my wife is actually going to Chase Bank uh, right now. In fact, I think she's there now to try to set up a bank account as a test and to try to get a business account and get this literature that we cannot make foreign wire transfers and uh, restrict money. So we'll have that double devil documented, as they say, uh, in the next 20 minutes or so. And this is so big, I think I'm going to go over there. I mean, I'll, I'll just go over my iPhone, shoot the report myself. Uh, the reporter's doing a great job. They're all nailed down to other stuff right now. That's why I need to hire more people. That's why it's great when you get the great products at InfoWarsHealth.com and places like that. When, you know, once a month or so, we do a little plug for this stuff. That's how we fund our operation. I go out and find great stuff. 
my incredible stressful life working 18 hours a day many days and I couldn't have done this without pharmacist Ben Fuchs advising me the last four years uh, with people like Dr. Group, people like Mike Adams, the health ranger. Uh, and it's just, it is exciting because if I'd have known this when I was young, before I tore myself up and ate like a pig and drank and, you know, did all the stuff I did for 12 years. I mean, it was just amazing. If I'd have known this when I was playing football and was in great shape, I mean, this stuff is dynamic. But I didn't mean to go off into a rant about health stuff. Let me ask, Ben, you're a smart guy, business owner in your own right, big compounding pharmacy in Colorado. What do you make of Obamacare, the shutdown, uh, all the preparations for urban warfare? I mean, I think they're purposefully trying to wreck the country. What do you think's happening? They want us scared, Alex. They want us running. They want us uh, to be chicken little. The fact of the matter is, is that you don't do your best work when you're scared. You cannot heal. You cannot grow. You cannot thrive. Your brain shrinks when you're in fear. That's what they're looking for, is to have people freaked out. And that's why it's so important to take control of your life. Alex, the last thing you ever want to have to do is go to an Obamacare doctor. Even doctors will tell you that. Even doctors are going to tell you that you don't want to go to an Obamacare physician. Once we have government mandated in, uh, medical care where the government works off a formulary and you pick your, uh, there's a, a menu of, of treatments or a menu of pharmaceuticals, it's all over. Then they have complete control over your body. And this is why it's so important to be proactive, to get yourself on a supplement program, to learn how to hack into your appetite, your appetite, uh, uh, your cravings for foods, use salt, use oils, use protein. All of these will uh, allow you to wean yourself off of the corporate swill. The last thing you ever want to do is participate in government mandated health care or to eat corporate inspired food. And the best way to protect yourself from all of this, Alex, the way I look at it, is to number one, make sure you're getting on a good nutritional supplement program. And number two, take control of your mind. Take control of your emotions and your feelings. Don't buy in to the, the, the uh, fear tactics of government shutdown and all the things that they want you to think. Don't buy into it. Get yourself on a good nutritional supplement program, get yourself on an exercise program, read good books, read spiritual books, access some kind of spirituality in your life, take control of your existence. That's the best thing you can do, and that's the best protection you can, you can have the way I look at it. And, and, and that's it. Tune out of the mainstream TV, really reconnect with nature, just get centered. Exactly. There's a exactly. whole universe out there, not just these globalist crooks that want to that's make right. themselves the center of everything. Just like the establishment medical system, begin to research and then control your own chemical, uh, electrochemical uh, biology, your own chemistry. That's the last thing they want. Ask yourselves, what are you doing in this time of great challenge? What are you doing to unlock minds? Yeah, this is guaranteed to get national attention now. With two different Paul Watson's been adding to his story now that it's gone up on Drudge. No, no, three different Chase banks uh, are now, uh, we have three different letters saying uh, to customers, and my wife's been calling, I need to call her and see if it's triple confirmed, that yes, folks, Chase Manhattan is telling people they can't wire money out of the country or take cash out. Oh, my goodness. I, I, November 17th. This is Twilight Zone, if people realize how horrible that news is. I want to shift gears, though, back to Ben Fuchs. Um, and what we were just talking about with pharmacist Ben Fuchs, Brightside Ben, he's got an hour-long show every day, getting picked up by a lot of stations right before mine on GCN, GCNlive.com, BrightsideBen.com. He joins us. We only have about four minutes left, Ben. I'm pretty shook up right now with this banking thing. But again, this is something we could take control of for now. The problem is... Under the, 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 the big pharma, as you know, writing, and I've been actually watching. I got addicted to this. I've probably watched, let's not exaggerate, 30 hours of Codex Elementarius voting and meetings going back about six, seven years on the Internet that I've seen from the U.N. And I didn't know. It's actually, it is big pharma, and they want it banned where you can't even buy uh, vitamin C in a bottle. I thought it was just lowered it down like some European countries have done to nothing. They really are very close. People don't know this to like not even letting you get vitamin D in mass. I, I mean, these people are out of control.
Why do you think, Alex, why do you think they're so hell-bent on keeping people from having vitamins? You know, when you come right down to it, Alex, we are vitamins. We are minerals. We are protein and carbohydrates and fat. We're and they want to sell all their artificial garbage that's toxic. They don't want us having what we are. They want to poison the environment, poison the water, poison the food, and then deprive us of what we need to protect us from the poison. You know, it's like a one-two punch. And I'm telling you, Alex, as long as we have the ability to buy nutrients, this is, this is something people want to take advantage of. Whatever kind of supplements you want, you want to start taking advantage of this right away. You want to start taking advantage of this today. Get yourself on a supplement program. Start to use macronutrition, meaning protein and essential fatty acids, and uh, making sure you're staying away from corporate swill, making sure you're re restricting your intake of refined foods and refined carbohydrates. You know, these are things that we can do today, and these are things we should be doing today. And the upside of all of this, Alex, is you're going to feel better. You're going to be more resistant to disease. You're going to be more resistant to the poison that's in the water and in the atmosphere and in the environment. And you know what, Alex? It's a friggin' no-brainer. I don't know what... I don't know what kind of downside people can see to getting on a good, solid nutritional supplement program and protecting themselves from these kinds of toxins and toxicity that's in our environment. You said it. Well, if folks can't get the high-quality nascent iodine at InfoWarsLife.com, they can pre-order it. We sold out. More is coming in a few weeks. So it's like three weeks out after we ship it to people, um, you know, victims of our own success. But it really is amazing. Uh, the monophyllin, I, I got a lot of energy out of that. Nothing compared, obviously, to the uh, to the nascent iodine, the proper type. Uh, there's obviously the InfoWars uh, health type put out by Longevity. That's a wide spectrum of sea plants. Ancient legacy, I'm told, is pretty powerful. What else would you find over at InfoWarsHealth.com? Uh, most important is the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, the essential fatty acids, the ultimate EFAs, the digestive enzymes. You know, we need to talk about the importance of digestive enzymes for protecting your body from bisphenol A. One of the best ways that you can protect yourself from toxicity and plastics and in, in the environment is to improve your body's ability to clear these toxicity, uh, these toxins out. And one of the most important strategies for clearing out toxins is bile, B-I-L-E, bile, that stuff that's made in the liver that nobody ever talks about is one of the most important detoxifying substances in your body. And you get the precursors to bile in the ultimate enzymes from longevity. Very underappreciated product. And, and, and I was also reading, tell me if, I'm, if I interpreted this wrong, that the, the, the liver also almost vomits out its toxins in the bile to be flushed out. That's exactly right. And keep, keeping your liver, taking care of your liver is also very important. By the way, bisphenol A is almost specific for toxing out the liver. It's incredible. All right, uh, Brightside Ben. Folks will be tuning in, I know, tomorrow, 10 a.m. Central, GCNlive.com. Thank you so much for spending time with us. Thank you. God bless. We'll have Bye -bye. more tonight on The Chase Situation, 7 o'clock. Alex Jones here to warn you about some of the most important health information you may ever hear. I'm talking about radiation, radioactive fallout, radioactive particles contaminating the Northern Hemisphere. Conservatively, since the 1940s, the Northern Hemisphere of our planet has more than doubled its background radiation. In fact, that was before Fukushima exploded. Now the levels are going up and up and up. Fish are contaminated in the Pacific, and the FDA, the EPA, and others, they're not worried about it. They've been raising the levels of what they claim is safe radioactive particles. Well, I began to discuss with my wife protecting myself, her, and of course our children. Most importantly, I have three small children, ages 10, 9, and 5. Radiation really affects children more than adults because they have fast-growing cells. All the literature is clear on that. And I went and talked to medical doctors, scientists, nuclear physicists, nutritionists, and I said, what's the number one thing I can do to protect my family? And they said, Alex, it's leave the northern hemisphere. Go south of the equator. That's where the radiation levels are very, very low. If you look at the wind patterns, the north hardly interacts with the south. And it's unfortunate that we've done this to our planet. So after more than two years of research into how to protect my family, looking at all the literature, talking to the experts, across the board they agreed, iodine is key, but of the family of iodine, nascent, natural, 
non-GMO, non-factory iodine that comes from the earth is absolutely paramount for your thyroid and other functions in the body. The literature, the research, it's there. It's not my opinion. It is admitted that iodine is essential for the health of our bodies overall and nascent iodine is the best form. Now, we're announcing the launch of InfoWarsLife.com and we're going to bring you scores of products over the next few years that we're researching and developing. But nascent iodine is the first product we're coming out with because it's so important and it's also listed as a fluoride detoxer. It does so many other things. Your body needs it and when you don't have enough iodine, forget the radiation, your thyroid absorbs the sodium fluoride and other things. And it's the good iodine, the nascent iodine, that is able to block that and just do so many things uh, for your body and your health. I've been taking it. It's amazing. It's a lot better than coffee, I'm here to tell you. And that's why we are now offering our own nascent iodine that's double the strength, made in the best laboratory that is uh, FDA uh, certified and accredited. And it is double strength at half the price of the leading competitor. You know my rule, bring you the highest quality products at the lowest prices we can so it's a win-win-win. I believe in you reap what you sow. So not only do we get the best deal on nascent iodine at InfoWarsLife.com for your general health and also for any type of emergencies or disasters, you will also be getting a great deal and supporting the InfoWar and our news operation, promoting the cure for tyranny, the First Amendment, promoting liberty and a rediscovery of the Bill of Rights and Constitution and true Americana that's made this nation so great. So please join me in being among the first to visit InfoWarsLife.com. We've got discounts if you buy the nascent iodine in bulk. I challenge you to try to find a better deal. We have the best deal out there and the best quality. In closing, here is probably the most important point. You don't just take nascent iodine when disaster strikes, when there's some new giant disaster. The Northern Hemisphere is already double what it was 60 years ago with the radioactive background. I believe from the research I've done and the experts I've talked to, it is key to take nascent iodine to protect your thyroid from the radiological disaster that's already happened and unfortunately future disasters that will happen. That's why it's important to fill your thyroid up now with the healthy nascent iodine so that the sodium fluoride, the radioactive isotopes and the rest of it can't get in. That's the key. This is something that across the board has been shown in study after study to be an absolutely essential nutrient in the body. Until a few decades ago, the government put it in the salt because they knew you needed it. But then they took that out that's good for the thyroid and put the sodium fluoride in that's bad for it. Talk about eugenics, talk about soft kill, talk about an invisible weapon in the water supply. This stuff is on record as a detoxifier for the fluoride they're adding to our water. Nascent iodine and InfoWars Life Survival Shield in double strength at half the cost of the leading competitors. Please visit InfoWarsLife.com today. <laughs>